find the LCM and HCF of 15, 25 and 75. To find the HCF and LCM, first we should do the prime factorization of each number separately. That is C. 15, 25 and 75. Okay, next. Here we have 15, 15 is 5, 3 is 15. Now we have 3, 3 is a prime number, so 3, 1 is 3. Now the other number, 25, 25 is 5, 5 is 25. Now we have 5, 5 is a prime number, so 5, 1 is 5. Now the other number. 75 last digit 5 so we take 5 here first number 7 a number close to 7 in 5 table is 5 1 5 7 minus 5 2 2 carried forward making it 25 when do we get 25 in 5 table 5 5 is 25 now here it is 15 15 is 5 3 is 15 now we have 3 3 is a prime number so 3 1 is 3 now our HCF is, HCF is the product of numbers which should be present over here and here and also here. I repeat, HCF is the product of numbers which should be present in these three places here and here and also here so now let us find the numbers which are present here and here and also here starting with the number 5 do we have 5 here yes next place do we have 5 here yes so you cut 5 and write here next number 3 do we have 3 here no no need to check in the other place no more numbers have been left therefore we got only one number 5 present in all the three places so 5 itself is our hcf i repeat we got only one number 5 present in all the three places so 5 itself is our HCF. Now to get LCM. Whatever HCF we got, to that we should multiply by the numbers which appeared either once or twice in these three places. What I mean is C. Over here 3 is not cut. Do we have 3 here? No. Next place, do we have 3 here? Yes. So you cut 3 in these two places and write here. Here each number has been cut, here 5 is not cut. Other place, do we have 5? Yes. So you cut 5 and write here. For the LCM, number should be present in all the three places. For LCM not like that, even if it is present in one place or two place, till you cut and write here. Now each number has been cut. So our LCM is 5 into 3, 15 into 5, 75 is our LCM. Am I clear? 